Yeah, I think a lot of his me- uh, mental, a lot of psyche going on, and you know, Billy Napier and him even said this week that uh, they've there's not a lot behind Anthony Richardson right now, and that may have played into uh, a bit of seeing you know it, the the, you know, the the run game not be not be a focus in this offense. But my thing was, you know, that Florida was in the same situation versus Utah. You know, the quarterback depth chart hasn't changed. Uh, Jack Miller was out that game. Not probably going to be available for the Tennessee game. So you know, Jalen Kitna is now kind of maybe shooting at the depth chart behind Anthony Richardson. But you know, the depth chart didn't change from Utah to Kentucky to, to South Florida. So I'm not going to buy it a little bit, but you know, I just I think it's a mental approach for him. I think he lost a lot of confidence in that Kentucky game, and you you could really see it. And there's been some whispers of an injury here or there too, and you know, maybe not affecting the play, but maybe affecting his psyche of. All right, well, I can't get hurt, or I don't want to get hurt. You know, and I think uh, you, you, you've seen that come into play, too. But I also want to give some credit to some defenses out there. I think Florida put a lot on tape versus Utah. Kentucky come in knowing how to defend it. Every time Anthony Richardson rolls out, there was somebody in his face, somebody waiting on him. Uh, so I think defenses have done a good job, too, of maybe just keeping him in the pocket, not letting him roll out and be comfortable in those rollouts. Uh, so I think all of it combined has just really affected him mentally. and He's just not comfortable playing quarterback right now.